right, there's an update in the game today. We are gonna get set three headliners. In the set one headliners, we had Jeff Bagwell as the feature diamond. Set two, have my boy Jimmy Rollins as the feature diamond. Today, we are gonna get the set three headliner pack. I'm not sure who the diamond player is gonna be, but we will have a brand new diamond in MLB The Show today. It may even be updated by the time this video goes live, I'm not sure, but I will have another pack opening up later tonight with those new set three headliners. So if you wanna see me take a stab at these packs and potentially get that feature headliner player, definitely keep the notifications on and come back to the channel later tonight. I'm also gonna have gameplay up later today doing a little debut of Chuck Nasty. I gotta do a voiceover on that video. Unfortunately, I had audio issues uh, when I was recording that, but we will get the video up. It's awesome gameplay. Checking out Chuck Nasty and the Evo Carlos Gonzalez. So three videos today, starting with this one right now. And today's video, as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, is all about these diamond pulls that we got on stream the other night. But after those diamond pulls, we went through and we did a bunch more collections. We actually end up unlocking 50 15 diamonds in total in this video. We did this live on Twitch the other day. So shoot me a follow on Twitch. I'll be live again tonight at seven o'clock Eastern time. We'll be live for a few hours getting some stuff done. So come hang out over there, say what's up. So let's get into it. Let's recap these pulls that we got and all the collections that we completed. I actually do have the live reactions for these diamond pulls. I may have to edit it a little bit weird because I was listening to music and I don't want to get hit with a copyright claim, but we do have the reactions. Let's get into it. So like I was saying, live on Twitch, I decided to rip a 50 bundle and the 50 bundle was really, really dry. As you can see, I'm simulating through these packs here. I'm getting nothing but, but bronze players, really. We get a couple silvers mixed in here and there, but this was probably the worst 50 bundle that we pulled all year so far, the entire first opening week of MLB The Show 20. This was the worst bundle that we got. And I actually wasn't going to open a second bundle until we got crazy, crazy lucky with just two packs remaining in this bundle. You're not gonna believe who we got. It was an 89 overall M. I mean, come on, I'm not gonna ruin it. We'll just watch the replay. I got the highlight. Playing any games tonight? We already won! Oh, let's go! Let's go! The pajama pants are out! Let's go! Whose man is this? Come on! MV Yelly on the squad. Huge pull, so I'm like, all right, you know what? The, the luck just turned around there. Let's go ahead and rip another 50 bundle. Why not? So I decided to buy another bundle, start ripping open those packs, and just a few packs later, Show me Ronald. It's a National League center fielder. Live series. Ronald, baby. Ronald and Yelich back to back. That's right, Ronald Acuna. We got 289 overall diamonds over 100,000 stubs in value on those two pulls. And it was in like a six pack window where we got those two. So we ended up getting all of our, by the time we went through and sold all the bronze and silver cards that we got in the first bundle, and um, obviously we did the collections, we ended up getting our value back for these packs and some we profited off of these 250 bundles, but we did not stop there. Just a couple packs after Ronald Acuna, we got a third diamond, and this one is what inspired my collections that we're gonna get into after the packs. Already did their collection so I can flip that. All right, I'm giving away a PSN card on that note. Who is it? Who is it? National League. First base, is it Freddy? Please tell me it's Freddy. It's a left-handed stick. The Braves are done. Let's go. Insanity, right? Ronald Acuna and Freddie Freeman. That's the, that's the Braves collection right there. So I decided, you know what? Let me go through my collection. Let's sell all those duplicates that we got through those packs get our stub bank back up a little bit. Um, I think we ended up selling over 30,000 stubs worth of duplicates by the time it was all done. Decent amount of silvers. Make sure you're flipping your bronze cards, guys. Do not sell now on your bronze cards. Make sure you're putting sell orders in. 
along with Freddie Freeman and Ronald Acuna for the Braves and Christian Yelich for the Brewers. I also won 12 games on an event run, that same Twitch stream. So we actually unlocked Francisco Lindor for free. So we already had Jose Ramirez pulled from pack squads. We got Francisco Lindor for winning 12 in events. We completed the Indians collection and that gave us the 88 overall. Cody Allen, and I, I then decided to slide over to the Atlanta Braves, start working on that Braves collection for the 87 overall. Ryan Klesko, we got that done, just putting buy orders in on those commons and bronze cards. Once you have the diamonds, these collections are super cheap. Just gotta make sure that you're penny pinching, putting buy orders in, trying to save stubs so that you can mac maximize your stub bank. The next collection that we completed was the St. Louis Cardinals. I put a buy order in for Jack Flaherty, got that diamond Jason Isringhouse, and I then went over to the Phillies, my Phillies. I bought Bryce Harper, JT Romuto, finished the Phillies. We got Robin Roberts, that diamond starting pitcher, another new legend in the game. Then I thought, you know what, let's try and do the Mets. I was having a little bit of trouble on stream. We had a troll who kept undercutting us on the market. He was watching me do the market live and just kept purposely undercutting me so that my buy orders wouldn't go in. So it actually took me a while to get these done. We do eventually end up completing the Cubs for Mark Pryor. We did get Javi Baez. And then we did the Mets for John Olerud when our Jacob deGrom buy order finally went through. I actually had to end up, I turned my screen off. I had to go to just a full screen of my face cam so that that guy didn't know what I was doing on the market. It was very annoying. It delayed the stream by like a half hour, but it is what it is. After we did all those team collections, we ended up completing the NL Central. That unlocked Willie Stargell, the 90 overall. And we also had the five teams done for the AL Central. So that got us Walter Johnson, the 90 overall starting pitcher for our final collection of the video. But wait, there's more. Right after I finished up, I just realized, you know what? We have 70 stubs, 1,000 stubs left. I was gonna wait. I was gonna keep those stubs, use them on pack squads, but I decided no. We're gonna buy Nolan Arenado finish the Rockies, unlock the 85 Adam Montevito, and now we are done with the collections. All in all, we got 17 diamonds in this video. We completed eight collections. We did the Braves, the Brewers, the Phillies, the Rockies, the Cubs, the Mets, the Indians, the NL Central, and the AL Central, and we got that all done. We are just a handful of collections away from completing all of the major league teams. We have the Dodgers, the Astros, the Angels, and the Nationals, four of the more expensive collections that we have to complete, but we have a large chunk of the players that we need for those. We just gotta get like the one expensive diamond. We need Cody Bellinger for the Dodgers. We already have Walker Buehler, Clayton Kershaw, Mookie Betts. Um, the Nationals, we already have Juan Soto. We just need Max Scherzer. The Astros have four diamonds, but none of them are really crazy expensive. I'm probably gonna do them last. The real, the big key is Mike Trout. Maybe we can get lucky and pull Mike Trout, who knows. But we gotta get those four collections done and we will have all of the teams done for 99 Mickey Mantle. Just wanted to give you guys an update on everything we had going on. The Twitch stream the other night was crazy. As you saw with the pack reactions, we were having a ton of fun on stream. The pack luck went from real bad to absolutely insane like that. It happened very quickly. Stream was crazy. We hit a thousand subscribers on Twitch yesterday, which is just like, a dream comes out like I never thought I would be at that level on Twitch where we're like having almost 2,000 people in stream and a thousand people are signed up as sub. It's just, it's mind boggling and I appreciate all the support. YouTube's been crazy, Twitch has been crazy. Looking forward to hanging out with you guys again tonight and all weekend long. I'm gonna be live on Twitch again tonight at seven o'clock Eastern and then I'll be live again tomorrow at 10 a.m. on Saturday. So we got a night stream tonight a morning stream tomorrow. Gonna take Sunday off from Twitch, but I will have YouTube videos up. So notifications on on Twitch, notifications on on YouTube. Gonna have Carlos Gonzalez and Chuck Nasty debut later today, along with that set three headliner pack opening later tonight as well. So two more videos today, pack squads tomorrow, a pack and play on Sunday. Lots of fun stuff coming. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit that thumbs up down below. Go to the comment section. How's your pack look, man? What diamonds have you been pulling? Did you get lucky with set one or set two? Did you pull Jeff Bagwell or Jimmy Rollins? Let me know. So until next time, guys, again, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys later on today. We are gonna triple upload and stream on Twitch today. Looking forward to seeing you guys later. I'm out. Peace. Choi Garner and Jake Lamb. Uh, infield's gonna be Jose Ramirez, Trevor Story, Whit Merrifield, Vladdy. Vladdy went three for four in his debut in the last video. Will Smith behind the plate, creative player, Lorenzo Kane and Fran Mel Reyes in the outfield. 
pitching staff, we added Kershaw, Paxton, and Ryu to the pitching staff in the last video. Nola threw a gem in episode one. He's still getting his energy back. Steven Wright pitched game two. Uh, bullpen, Sean Doolittle, Dylan Batances, Kella, Garcia, Dominguez, Carl uh, Edwards Jr., and Brett Suter are the pitching staff. If you're new to this